Good day everyone. My name is Shelly Marilina Kwe from BSHM1A and for today's video, I will talk about the Filipino artist Pecha Kucha of Fabian de la Rosa. Don Fabian de la Rosa, Kieto was a Filipino painter. He was the uncle and mentor to the Philippines national artist in painting, Fernando Amorsolo, and to his brother Pablo. He is regarded as a master of genre in the Philippine art. Fabian de la Rosa was born May 5, 1869 in Paco, Manila to husband and wife Marcos de la Rosa and Gargonia Cueto. Born to a family of artists, he was exposed to art at an early age and learned to draw well before he could write. He was trained to sketch, portrait, and landscapes. By his aunt Marciana de la Rosa, when he was 10 years old, he also apprenticed under his uncle Simeon Flores de la Rosa, a well-known painter of portrait and church interiors from the 19th century. De La Rosa lived most of his life in Philippines and visited Europe for the first time when he was 39. He married Gorgonia Talentino on January 13, 1900. De La Rosa received formal education at the age of 12 when he enrolled at the Escuela de Artes Officios in 1881. Three years into his training, De La Rosa's father died forcing the young painter to drop out of the school in order to help feed his family. It was during this time that he painted his first non-masterpiece, La Perla de Lupan. In 1893, he entered the Escuela Superior de Pintura Escultura Gabrado at the age of 24, where he received training from Lorenzo Guerrero and Miguel Zaragoza. In 1898, De La Rosa won a contest for a scholarship to Spanish Art Academy of San Fernando in Madrid. However, the outbreak of the Philippine Revolution meant his dream would not materialize. Later, under the American regime, the Escuela would become one of the three founding units of the University of the Philippines and renamed the UP School of Fine Art. In 1908, he traveled to Europe as a pensionado through a scholarship opportunity given by the Germinal Cigar Factory. He attended the Academy Julian in Paris, France. After traveling from Europe, he became one of the first instructors at the School of Fine Arts at the University of the Philippines, where he introduced to his student the decorate form of painting. Miller Rosa became the full director of the school from 1927 to 1937. Together with his wife, De La Rosa went back to Europe in 1928, where he painted in Paris for four months. He also traveled to Munich, Germany, Geneva, Switzerland, and Rome. Upon reaching Madrid, Spain, he held an exhibit of his work at Ateneo de Madrid. It is believed that De La Rosa was able to paint about 1,000 works. De La Rosa's work were divided by Aurelio S. Alvel into three time periods. Those that are academic but are not giving importance to atmosphere and appearance. Those that have academic form that gives importance to the environment that could be sensed and those that play with the use of colors. And these are some of the work of Fabian de la Rosa. Human working in a rice field. Oil on canvas 1902. Percasas. Thank you for watching and listening about the Pecha Kucha of Fabian de la Rosa.